It is actually the first Android I've recommend, battery, power and everything is premium on this phone. So similar in specs to the 11 Pro Max, and more than half the price. This is not a problem but is heavy. This is such a beautiful and awesome phone for the price. The camera is way better than any iPhone I've ever tried and the battery life easily lasts 2 days. Everything about this phone is perfect and for the price it's just as good as the $1000 flagship phones that are out now. I've been daily using this phone about 4 months with no issues. Excellent camera and very fast phone but the software is bad. While not having the fastest processor, unless you are gaming etc you really don't notice. Cameras are nice and this phone is a solid offer for mid-tier smartphones. The MyUI UI takes a little getting used to, but after a week it's fine. Does everything phones costing 3xs as much does, just a hair slower and while the screen is not the best in show it is no slouch. If you watch that many movies on her phone, this one is not going to stop you from that. Overall really good value. I really like this mobile with such a reasonable price it takes your photos to a different level as any expensive DSLR camera. I used to think a lot about carrying my camera to shoot my pictures anywhere and anytime but with this mobile I don't have to worry about taking my pro camera to have some end. Everything work well, the 108MP camera is super nice. Competes with flagships for half the price. Top-notch camera. The fingerprint scanner is slow at times, but nothing noticeable. I am most upset that I can't use tempered glass without it interfering with the fingerprint scanner, and I actually cracked it yesterday. To add to that no repair shops keep screen replacements for it in stock since it's not extremely popular. Note sticky scrolling. The 108 sensor shoots a clearer picture than the Mate. Note battery lasts longer. Phones are the same size. Note has FM radio. Bluetooth better on Note. Both charge fast. Mate came with wired earphones. Transferring, copying, contacts was more complete on Mate. Note has no SD slot. Note weighs a bit more. Software skin takes some practice on Note. Though easy. Note costs less. FYI, I bought the Note for the 108 camera. It works well. If you don't mind an occasional shutter, my vote goes to the MI Note 10. This is my first Xiaomi phone, and I have used it for over a month now. Feel free to question my experience. Click link in description for more reviews.